What's up guys, in this video I figured out how to record in three dimensions. I don't even know how to explain it, but I talked to a certain mod creator, and they said, yeah, I'll give you access to this mod, and now I can record in three dimensions, and you guys can watch it. And by the way, yes, I know, my color code is black, that's because the computer's a little bit scuffed up in this mod. For now, I'm just stuck in private lobbies, I guess. Also guys, oh, guys, make sure you join the Discord, because we just hit 300 members, and I'm gonna be doing some Nitro giveaways and stuff. I'm gonna be doing videos with codes and stuff, so you guys gotta be in there for that, alright? Alright. Now let's get on with the video. Now you guys can't see it right now, but I have a specific menu built into SteamVR just for this. We're gonna have to switch over to SteamVR view, so I'm just gonna grab you guys real quick. <clears throat> there we go. Feeling much better. I'm gonna just put this away for now. Ooh, what's that? What's that? So if we're just looking around, you know, you don't really notice anything weird, aside from the little dot that sometimes turns into a pointer. But yeah, as we look off into the distance, let's just turn around real quick and... Yeah, that's not a gorilla attack at all. And this is the little menu, so you might be wondering why is it like... Why is my head chopped off? I don't normally think people are six foot two, so I'm a little bit tall for this. So, you know, it's gonna be cutting off my head a little bit. But don't even worry about that, guys. I'm gonna fix this. Move that up. There we go. Now, as you can see, my face is a little bit cut up, so... We're gonna have to turn these, the cameras, around. And there we go, we got our little guy. He's looking pretty snazzy. Now, let's just go ahead and get rid of this little menu. We can watch a little mini version of ourselves just running around, that's so cool. Now, you guys might be wondering how is this happening, and if you haven't already guessed it, these are cameras, actually. Now, how it works is basically it's just taking two cameras, projecting it back. If I stand back up against it, you can see the cameras can't really see what's happening back here, so it's just gonna delete it. Now, you can also bring the cameras closer, farther away. I think, uh, let's put it like right there. That's pretty good. Now, if we just get rid of literally, oh my gosh, you can see like the whole entire map basically. Oh my, look at that, that is crazy. Now we're gonna bring that a little bit closer because we don't want to see the entire goddamn map. That is so cool. As we're just running around, you can see everything that's happening in like a little mini view. Now this might be kind of annoying to have to watch like this. What do you mean record in 3D? Like, wow, cool. You can have like a 3D little mini map. Like here, let me show you the GUI. So this is the preview. Here's what you can see. And then this is the preview settings where you can change the scale. You change which rotation you look at it at. So yeah, this is the camera settings where you can change it. This preview settings. And here's like the little vocab thing. You can like see all your recordings. Here I am trying to figure out what the hell is happening. For some reason it's picking up on my the wrong microphone, so I'm gonna go change that real quick. <laughs> this is like the folders, this is where you can see all your previous recordings. And here's recording. This is recording. So we're recording right now. Yeah, you can see the preview and everything. It's gonna be a little bit laggy because I'm picking up on quite a lot. So let's change the camera settings. And there we go, we're recording. So yeah, we're just gonna run around a little bit. As you can tell guys, uh, I don't know if this is really gonna pick up on the recording very well. But I'm lagging the hell out. But as you can probably guess, this is very early into development. I had to talk to one of like the head creators of this mod just to even get access. It was... It was a thing. <laughs> now I still kind of suck, but here in a minute we're gonna re-watch the recording that we're doing right here. Here we are, just jumping around. We're gonna... Let's run some walls actually. See how that looks. Whew. Well, I think that's enough recording for that. Let's go and watch the recordings. Here we are, just running out of there. Here we are, just jumping around. We're gonna, let's run some walls, actually. Let's see how that looks. Oof. That is awesome. Oh, that's weird. You can actually, like, see outside of the Unity map if you're moving a lot. Pretty damn cool. Here we are, just jumping around. So, you can't really record too far out, or else you start to, um, lag. I'm pretty sure this is running off of your CPU, also, which... I, I'm not too sure about that. That'd be kind of sucky, considering I am kind of wasting my 4060. <laughs> yeah, 4060 Ti, and it's being used for Gorilla Tag. So the creator of this, well, I, I think one of the creators, actually gave me a Google spreadsheet so I can upload videos of what <laughs> I've, I'm doing, so I th I'd say we should try that. Yeah! I want to record over here, so... All right, let's see. Let's see how that ended up. That, that I got high expectations for this one, actually. 
Okay, well, what the fuck? No. Again. <laughs> there we go, that's good, that's good. I like that one, I like that one. Alright, I think that one was pretty good. It was short, it was sweet, it was precise. Audio was crap, though. <laughs> the audio has some work to be done, but I can't really work on that, you know, because I'm too lazy, so. Also, this is the first ever video I've ever uploaded to the live thing. Oh, by the way, I should probably explain what it is. <laughs> basically, it's called Project Spatial, and it's by Liv. If you don't know who Liv are, basically, Liv is this company that creates software for VR. The only other thing I've seen by them, really, is their video where they had someone in real life do mocap with Gorilla Tech, which was really cool. How I found this mod was I was just scrolling around on TikTok, and I found a video by them. I'm like, yo, this is sick. I gotta talk to the owner. So I did. Now let's go and upload the video. By the way, guys, I'm not short. I'm just sitting down. So I'm going to be showing you guys, like, what I mean by the spatial thing, so. So if we pop up in the Steam store or the Oculus store, you can go over, search up. So let's go over, search up, live. There we go, live. And right here, it says, play the live playtest now, and you can sign up, and you can play now. So I'm going to play now. It's a really small download, then it should start booting up. It looks like this, and oh, there we go, there we go. It's buggy, it's a prototype, it's in beta. Everything is super early now. So here we got the little ball. So this actually works best if you're in, uh, I'll pause that actually. But look at that, you can like see what's going on. You can stick your head in there, you can see what's going on from behind. You can get a little behind the scenes, you know how it be, you know how it be. So if we just stick our head in here, look how cool that is. Here, let's just. Let's grab this. So this video is by Adam Bomb Body, and they're actually a YouTuber. They got like 6,000 subscribers. They helped make the mod, which is awesome. So it's like a little introduction video. So let's, uh, we can actually discover it. So I'm gonna show you guys what that looks like. So let's put you over there, little buddy. So we got the cool stuff. So we use this for some reason, I don't know why, but you can also use this, the clicker. So we can look around, you know, see what's going on. Uh, I wanna watch the store decoration video, so let's watch that. Whoa, you go inside, you can look around. Yeah, as you can see, this is a pretty old mod. Not old, it's still relatively new. You can go from a circle to a goddamn TV. If you guys have the Quest 3, you can install this and then put it anywhere in your room. I think I'll have a video up or something. And it's not usually this laggy, but I just have terrible internet. <laughs> this is by Lo, another creator. I'm assuming. One day, this is gonna be the future YouTube videos, bro. Trust me. <laughs> you can like change the size. You can have this sitting over here. I'm not gonna show my friends list over there, so we're gonna probably have to move somewhere else. So let's move over here, actually. Let's say you're on the Quest 3. You can just have this little TV hanging out around here. Just have this like hanging out in your room. Just be watching a Gorilla Tag YouTube video. Look at him, just staring at those guys. Wanna look around a little bit, you know. Now, if you guys probably couldn't guess, this mod is still super early in development. Now, if you guys want to get access to this, you have to have PC VR. And also, here's the Quest version of the app on the screen, so if you want to check that out, you know, you can. That'd be pretty cute. And if by the time I'm done editing this video and, you know, my video goes live, then I'm gonna, I'm gonna put that on the screen right now. If we go over to Discover, you can guess where it is. Yes, yeah, sir. Yes, yeah, sir. That's my video by Ambrose. Let's watch it. Oh, yeah. There we go. That's not <laughs> Demi Noah could get this game. Okay, yes, sir. That's <laughs> Yeah, I don't know what's with the science thing, though. Someone's got a weird science experiment. That's me. That's me. Yes, sir. That's yes, sir. That is so cool. Oh, Holy man. crap. Yeah. You can, like, look around the room, go inside. All right, well, that's it for the video. Bye-bye. I'm not going to become a full-time creator because you can only do, like, 60-second videos. That's so basically, like, YouTube shorts meets virtual reality, I guess. Which is pretty much what they want. Big shout-out to Lagger. I know I kind of rambled a lot in this video, but, like, come on. <laughs> this is awesome.